Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're going to be making this beautiful honeycomb sun catcher with the goodies we got inside the March Premium Elves box. Be sure to comment down below your best bee puns so we can all have a good laugh. So the first thing I did was I colored some UV resin and filled in the bee design in the coaster mold. I absolutely love this coaster mold and once I saw it I knew I didn't want it to just be a coaster. The design is just too pretty to put a cup on top of it. In case you missed the March box but are interested in this mold be sure to check the description box for a direct link and also a discount code. So once the bee was fully cured, it was time to add the epoxy resin. In this instance, I am using Illumilite Epoxy, a new resin to me that I recently got, but more on that later. I mixed it with this golden yellow pigment trying to achieve a real honey color, and to give it a bit more zhuzh, I added some gold leaf. Twenty-four hours later, I demolded the coaster and the little bee turned out perfect. Then I mixed up a little bit more of epoxy resin, put in a little of the heat color changing pigment, and filled the honeycomb cavities. One really cool thing that happened while I was filling in the cavities was that in the time I had the cup of resin in my hand, it got warm enough that the resin changed from orange to yellow, and the yellow is such a pretty color. After doming the coaster and leaving it to cure, it was time to make my little beehive and two extra bees with UV resin.
When using the Color Jewelry LED resin, be sure to shake the bottle a bit. I unfortunately didn't know and ended up wasting quite a lot of it, thinking it was a clear shimmery resin, when in fact it's actually a dark metallic gold resin. Another tip I have is to make it last a little longer, you can mix it with the regular UV resin to make more. I ended up having to do this to fill the beehive cavity completely. Once the little extras were made and the dome had cured, it was time to add the finishing touches. If you guys liked how this sun catcher turned out, be sure to sting that like button and don't forget to comment down below your bee puns. Thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!